I'm Jerry Reynolds, the Car Pro, and welcome to another edition of the Automotive News in Two Minutes. Tesla Motors has been on the razor's edge since it started building cars, but the company's getting some new momentum from Toyota. Tesla makes the electric roadster and it's gearing up for production on its Model S sedan. Now Toyota is asking Tesla to build the electric powertrain for its Toyota RAV4. That deal is worth an estimated $100 million. Now from electric power to sheer horsepower, this is the Ford Mustang GT Boss 302. 444 horsepower and it does it without a supercharger. This car has a look and sound like no other. But here's what's really impressive. It's a true muscle car that handles really well. Inside, Ford did it right, it's not cheap looking at all, and has just enough nostalgia to make any Mustang enthusiast happy. At just under $43,000, this may be the most memorable car I've ever driven. Now, it may seem at first like a few car companies are forgetting something. Some new cars are hitting the highway without a tire, the spare tire. In an effort to drop weight and sometimes the price, some car makers are opting to send you home without that fifth wheel. In fact, last month, 13% of all vehicles sold within the United States came without a spare. So instead of changing your flat tire, some less expensive cars are now being equipped with fix-a-flat sealant and an electric pump instead of a spare. The more expensive models are going with run-flat tires that can go another 50 miles after they've been punctured. And when it really comes down to it, more people are using roadside assistance to fix their flats anyway. Catch me on the radio Saturdays in Houston, San Antonio, Austin, Los Angeles, Sacramento, Lubbock, and Dallas-Fort Worth. Check the website, carproshow.com, for show times and details. I'm Jerry the Car Pro. Have a great week.